Hi Mini Moos, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Raylin, and today we're going to be watching episode 4 of A Byland Season 2. We're going to be expecting some special guests, I'm very excited. We're also going to see like a big shift with who's in island and who is in ground. According to the last dances, performances, I believe it's six grounders are gonna go to island and six islanders are gonna go to ground, which is crazy. I'm not sure why they did it like that, but ugh, it's gonna make things very intense. So let's get right into it. And yeah, on this channel, I do anything from singing videos to makeup tutorials and anything really trending in K-pop. So if that interests you, go ahead and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything new from me. Also, if you guys like the things that I wear, definitely check out Yes Style. I have a code with them. It's gonna be in the description down below. So go check them out and get a percentage off when you shop. But yeah, let's get right into the video. Okay, so I remember the girls on the ground. Three girls went to island and three girls got dropped down. Yeah, and this mission was crazy as well. Oh! Okay, honestly, that part ate so much. Oh my god, they killed that. Ah! And I loved her in this position as a center. She killed it. Even though I remember thinking that maybe she should be in um, the whistle, she should choose the whistle song if she would fit it. She definitely killed this song instead, so yeah. And the, the grounders did a good job as well. They improved so much, especially her. Well, maybe not especially, but she did really well. And she worked really hard. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we didn't get to really see them. So I want to see their full performance in this episode because I want to know why she's crying. What in the world? What did um, Monica mean by did we misunderstand something? Mm, I like helping her look cute. Mm. Oh, yeah. Her being cute is going to be very interesting. Will she be able to pull it off? I don't know. Because it's in... The episode two. Her attitude was not great. That's kind of why I feel like the Islanders wanted her to go to ground. But they just knew they didn't want to work with her, so she ended up going to ground. She was moody, she wasn't dancing. She was upset. Even when she got eliminated or put into ground, she was like kind of looking down to the grounders. And the Islanders, she was like giving them dirty looks, like she didn't want to hug any of them. So I don't know. She's so cute. There's certain girls that are killing it with this genre and the cutiness. Come on, guys, I thought they fixed the. No. I can see the potential in her with this um, genre. I can see the potential. She just needs to work on it. Mm -hmm. She's the best one. We had high expectations, but I think she met the expectations. Mm, good for her. She definitely sh should have been the leader, but I think they all wanted the other girl to be. Our friends have to go to wait. Also, those other two girls that like didn't remember the choreography. I don't know. She's gonna stuck on her regrets. Mm. She's very much in her head. Can we handle? That's a valid question because. Mm, right. Right, because I'm like, you can do a lot better. You're coming from Island, you were in Island for a reason. But it's not showing. Like, I wonder if she was like also very nervous as well, I'm not sure. Terrifying words. Oh. I cannot forgive myself. Not confident. Yeah. She does have a breakthrough. She's very much like I can't do it. I can't do it. Yeah. She's so good. 
She looks so sad right now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because I feel like if she debuts, what if they do different concepts as a group? Like, you can't be like, oh, I can't do it because it doesn't fit my vibe. He has a snap out of it. I feel like it's very interesting. I feel like from past episodes, you would think that, you know, she's just so unlikable. But I'm actually kind of rooting for her, which is interesting. Because I feel like... I Chia, she's very relatable in a sense. Whereas like maybe the rest of the girls are kind of like always adjusting well to the different trials. You can tell she's not and I feel like, I don't know, it, it makes her seem more human in a sense. So yeah, I am kind of rooting for her. She's not perfect. She has her flaws. So I want her to do well. Imagine if they're better than Fuko's team and they end up all going to island. It'd be crazy. Oh my god. Literally, wow. I feel like this whole choreography and performance is made for her. I need those girls to not make mistakes as well. <gasps> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'm cute. She has to tell herself. That was cute. Mm. Mm. She didn't even sing. Oh my god, no. I'm like losing hope. Oh, she's so good. She's making the entire performance. She's I feel like she's very nervous. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yes! I thought there was going to be a twist and they were going to be like exceptional, but no. Definitely needs a lot more work. There are some girls that are like so good. <gasps> the head shake is so bad. There's a good amount of girls in this group that need so much work. Dang. And June, I feel like she is good. She needed to work on it a lot more she just looks like she's very much in her head she just feels insecure but it was an improvement for sure from the rehearsal and i i can tell that she did work on it according to them it's not that different i thought it was an improvement maybe not a huge one but it was an improvement leader she has the most parts i don't even want to watch this i know she's gonna start crying Oh. Can also give you a chance to correct it. Because like, there's also going to be an elimination, so there's going to be girls going home. Misunderstanding. The song doesn't. I'm so lucky. Wow. Dang. He may become a singer. He can't do this. He's doing just enough. Okay, that is working very hard. Don't say thank you yet. Mm. It's giving those are the two girls going home. Fuko's team was definitely so much better. There's just so many girls in this group that are lacking. She did amazing. She brought the entire performance up without her. This performance would be awful. She carried it for sure. Still not enough. It's a pretty on the Oh my god, yeah. It's interesting because when she was in Ireland, I feel like she scored really well. And she did a good job, so I don't know what happened. At first she was like, oh, I don't want anyone to see me in, in ground. You know, pretty much like, I don't deserve to be here, you know? But now she's kind of humbling herself and being like, maybe there is 
more things that I need to work on. And I feel like it's good to have those moments where you're like, you're humbled and there are some, some things that she needs to work on. Her mindset, her confidence, her technique. That's so bad. Um, she's such a good friend for comforting her. I definitely feel like Fugle's team is gonna go to Island. Them. They did so well. And this team, they're definitely gonna stay in ground and there's gonna be an elimination from that crew for sure. Mm, I'd be so scared. Well, Islanders, I think that personally I like her Mai's team on ground. So is it like they get moved to ground and then those girls are gonna from those girls are gonna be going home or are they gonna do the elimination first? In front of everyone. Well, the other names are up there. I really do think that Sebi is going to have a high score. She blew me away. Same thing with Jimin. But in regards to the groups, I liked Whistle, but I think the other group is gonna. I like them the best, so I would want them to stay over Whistle, even though I love Jimin. Who's that? Is it showing like the two centers? So they have the same position? Mm. So she gave up dancing for the singing. I hope that she kept it up, in my opinion. So she's lowered by one point. Mm. Mine has a higher score, in my opinion. I just feel like Mai has more charisma, but we'll see. Because mm -hmm. I like Mai, even though like her rule, they show it so far. That is so intense! The fact that they're doing it like this, my heart would be pounding. Oh, this is a- oh, I think it's gonna- oh. Yeah, I don't think she's gonna get as much points. I think she's gonna get more points. Wow, what a twist. Oh my god, it's so close. She should be very proud of herself. This is who carries them. She did really well. I didn't think that she carried though, but I didn't think that she was going to get that much high of a score. So now they're only a point away. Who is going to be dropped down? It's so close. I think. Oh, sorry, three points. I feel like she has to have points in the 90s, is my... I'm bringing on stage. No! We... Wow, it's a panorama. So I knew that Sebi was going to get a good score, so she's in the 90s. She got 93. The other girl got 60-something. That's actually kind of disgraceful. I feel really bad for her. So, mm. If that was me, I'd be like, guys, I'm so sorry. Because that's it. I just loved the panorama performance so much better. But this is really sad. Like, mm, I liked both. Sorry. Oh, yes. They were the ones that. They were the ones that had that whole, like, tug of war between the two songs. And now one girl excels and another girl gets dropped down. I feel bad. This is not like goodbye, you know? Hopefully not. I don't think that any of these girls are gonna get eliminated. Like anyone from the whistle to comment. But then also we don't know how they're going to decide the expulsion. Is it gonna be like a mini challenge? So the grounders have to, are not able to see the scores. I wonder if they're... I wonder if the expulsion is going to happen right after this. It's definitely going to be Fugo's team that gets the highest scores, but... 
Oh my god, are they just gonna walk through? Who goes back? It's kind of hard because I feel like I, I feel like some of the girls that got sent to ground from island still deserve to be there over some of the girls that are not coming into island from ground. So that's why it's like so hard, so confusing why they did it this way. Yeah, I knew that. There's only a few girls where I'm like, okay, maybe it's time. Maybe you guys just need to leave the show, train more, and come back. God, it's so weird because I feel like I used to be like, oh my god, she's so kind of like unlikable, you know what I mean? That she was kind of looking down to the grounders. She was very smug, very, you know. But I feel like now that she's humbled, she show her more vulnerable side. Um, and I think she can really work her way up to be back on the island and do really well. So I'm kind of rooting for her in a weird way. Yeah. She's, so they're gonna watch it. It's wild. So all of those girls are up for elimination. That's crazy. Oh yeah, she's on a 68. I'd be worried as well if I was her, like, not even in the 70s, like, 68. Yeah, I just feel like there's a lot of girls that are not ready. And like her, like, she's, she knows that she's not the best at picking up choreography, so she's probably very worried. I'd be as well. Really? Really? You can breathe now. Girl. Oh my god. Oh god. Girls crying more than the people who are being eliminated. Unfortunately, it wasn't me. Girl, get it together. You're not going home. Like, oh my god. She's doing a lot. Okay. I said that because the girl with like the brown hair. I don't think she's going home. Hopefully not. I don't think so. I feel like the only critique for her was that she didn't stand out. The other girls like made mistakes, you know? Like they were very amateurish. I got this girl. Dang. Fugles tried to cry. The girl from Whistle, I really don't think she's leaving. I'd be shocked. She did poorly, but I, I think she did better than the other girls up for elimination. But she has potential, so it's hard. I think she actually does have potential, so it's really difficult. Okay. Yui keeps going. Her face. She's like, thank God. Yuiko, I liked. She definitely was more of an amateur, but she, I think, had potential. So it's sad, but. She's 15 years old. She can literally just keep training and do well again, you know? Yeah, compared to the other girls, like, she just wasn't up to par. So I'm not surprised that she left. Uh, so they got to see some of the girls that got to see what it looks like for the first time. Mm -hmm. I love her with the bangs. That This look suits her so well. She should keep this. She looks great. Ooh. Yikes. They must feel like, what the heck are we doing here? Play different from Island. Yeah. The music that they have playing is so rude. Now they all know how June felt coming down. She's like, whoa. I'm very excited to see how the girls are going to interact with each other now. Now that there's a new test, are the new girls that are joining Island, are they going to be able to keep up? I love this ground. Here we go. Oh, three will be expelled to ground, so not home. Expelled to ground. Okay. Or nine can be expelled, wow. So now they're happy because they're like, okay, here's our chance to go back to Island. Yeah, some of the grounders who have stayed in ground for a while, they're probably very excited because they're like, okay, there's some really talented islanders that are here with us in ground now, and they can help us be better, but also possibly get to island for the first time. So two more people are going home again. 
first unit. Oh my god, interesting. Two members in the vocal unit. Uh, so do they have to decide that or who decides this? Okay, I'm fine. Who is gonna sing this? Okay, this is gonna be so fun. So the vocalists from ground are gonna go against the vocalists in island. Oh, it's different. Oh, look at her. Mm. I love how they give her so much screen time. She must be very happy. She's stealing all of the scenes. She's a very interesting personality, I feel. Like the dance unit. Three members in the dance, okay. Okay, the dance unit is a mic drop. I need to see these performances. Oh, it switches. This is gonna be very fun because we get to see like the girls that are the best at those specific um things and they're hopefully gonna be able to like really really shine where they know that they can shine what's a creative unit that's hard mm. i figured a name but the girl from um street dance girls should do that because she has so much um <laughs> She has so much experience choreographing, they had to come up with so many dances on that show. So if I was her, I would do that because she knows that she would be better at the girls in Ireland. And we're going to come up with choreography. Ooh, right on me! Fuku definitely gives me like natural leader. I could see her taking charge, you know? She wants to be in vocal. Practice. She's good. She's good too. She's good too. All the girls are good. Mm. Yeah, I think she would do good. She was good too. Mm. They're both really talented, so this is going to be a good performance. I know like neither of them are going to have issues practicing and I feel like they're both very stable performers. Um. Oh, what? What are you doing? How can you be in the vocal, literally? Girl, don't do this. She just wants to do something different and I get it, but it's like, this is not the... Mm. She just wants to try it. She wants to like, stretch herself and like, improve in that area, which I get. But this is not the um, challenge to do that and experiment. Like, this is to do what you do best. Like, oh, come on. She has to think about the group. I know it sucks, but... Literally. Oh. I can't go. If you try to do vocal, the girls in Island are gonna eat you up. Come on, girl. Don't do that. If I could have her. I'll choose creative unit. Good. Please just do it next time because girl. June needs to be in it. Thank you very much. She's hopefully she can re like redeem herself and really kill it and feel confident and get her confidence back because she's finally doing something that she knows that she's good at. No. And they're good friends, so that would be cute. She could just work on it, and I think she'll actually be good. Perfect. So I feel like you know, June kind of le leans on her a little bit for like that support. She feels comfortable with her. I think that they'll be a very good matchup. I'm excited. And both their voices give me like, I don't know, emotion and like realness. I think she should, for sure. She's good. Yeah, also, just a little update. I feel like my bias is kind of changing more and more. I'm not 
100% on who is my new favorite. I still love Fuko a lot, but I think my bias is changing a little bit. I think it might be her, Juan. I think that's favorite on I'm not sure. Or Jimin, I love Jimin. Um, I love Mai as well. Sebi, I love. It's hard. Yeah. I don't know who my new, my new favorite is. Maybe at the end of this episode, I'll decide who my, my new favorite is. Okay, so she's in the dancing. Okay. I like her a lot as well. She's improved so much from earlier episodes. Yeah, she's improved so much. And she has really, really good facial expressions. I think she's going to do well. Mm. Good. It's going to have... That's what I'm saying. Like, can I sing again after practicing? So. so she, she's confident. So did they change her? No? Oh gosh, okay. I feel like they didn't change it. They're gonna kill it. Oh, her voice. Wow. That song was so high. Oh well. Mai is so adorable. They're gonna kill it. Seriously. Mm. I wish they didn't change the girls in the vocal unit in ground. Mm. <laughs> she always gets chosen to do like really good parts and she always acts so shocked like ah, me she's the perfect leader i feel like she comes up with good ideas like, she's very innovative i feel so okay, so she's later. Oh, I'm so excited for these units. I really want to see the finished performances so bad. Yeah, what was that? They look good. Mm, I'm excited. Her, I like her, but I feel like. I don't know. I feel like there's so many other girls that are better than her at singing and dancing and you know. I wonder if she will stay. But she can definitely improve, so. But she does seem like a decent dancer, so. Mm. Oh wow, so everyone left behind was the creative girls. Yikes. Oh. Okay, so. Yeah, no one has experienced choreographing. Doing? Creative unit in ground, they're going to eat them alive. If I was in this group and I knew that I was going against um, the Girl from Street dance girls, I would cry. When they're doing um, Rain on Me, this is going to be good. This might be like the saving grace for the grounders, honestly. Because the vocal unit, I don't know how if they'll be better than the Islanders or dance, but this creative unit, yeah. They're going to kill her. I think we'll learn. I think so too. And she wants to do vocal. Oh, bye. Mm -hmm. Who's going to the first floor? Big campus. Okay. Oh my god. Is this Somi? Or is it Monica? No. It's Somi. I'm gonna freak out. Oh my god. Special mentor. Ooh. Oh my gosh. I like a dream. Aww. It's so interesting because she's done series like this where she had to compete. It's so good. Mm. 
서바이벌의 생활도 알고 여러분 경험을 너무 많이 해서 그랬죠. 이 여기까지 나올라 했다가 지금 들어간 것 같은데. 아, 오케이. What does Vico want to say? 저는 뭔가 연습생 생활이 좀 힘들어 하면서 진짜. 근데 Oh, wow, that's very surprising. Oh, God, this is actually very surprising to hear. It's your second time, okay. Wow. That is so surprising because you would think that she's like the stable one, the confident one. Everyone turns to her and they know that she's always going to give that security in regards to like uh, putting on a good performance. Oh, that's very interesting that she's like, yeah, like. This has all been hard for me. Some of these girls are just so talented. Ugh. I feel so bad because I know not all of them are going to debut. So she feels like she's getting too old to be a trainee. Ugh, that's awful. She's literally only 19. She's so young. Oh, I love Sony so much. <laughs> She always seems so confident in herself, so. It's so interesting that she is getting so emotional. Jimin has to debut, like I really really think she is ready, you know? Mm. Yeah, of course, like imagine like Sony was like training with the Twice girls. Then they go off to be like huge and like so beloved. And then she goes back to another survival show. Like I would be so discouraged if I was her, but now she's such a cool like soloist. She should be proud of herself. I'm happy she came as a guest. This, I feel like this is probably gonna be my favorite challenge that they do. I don't know, I'm just so excited to see like what these girls are going to come up with. And it's going to be close, because there's so many people who have been in the island for a while that are now on ground. So I feel like, ooh, it could go either way. Vocal is first. I don't think that they should have switched the two girls. Girl, come on, like, this is what you do the best, so kill it. Seriously. Also, I wonder if they're allowed to know who they're up against. Have they found out or is it a surprise to each other? I don't want to have any regrets this time. Come on, girl. You need to redeem yourself, so. Mm. She looks so good. Oh my god. They have to watch each other. They look very pretty as well. Oh god, so they didn't know who they were up against before? Woo! Goodness. That is a down to them again. And when she replaced her, she was so upset. Woo! Girl. And she was really good. I don't know who's a better singer. I feel like Jiyoon might be better. But with that part, specifically, I think it was out of June's range and she couldn't really kill it. So hopefully now she's singing a song that's more closer to her range and she can really show off what she could do. So intense. Mm. Okay, so he's complimenting her a lot. I think her main issue was like her attitude towards all of these challenges and like, the pride of it all. I feel like she's now released that and become more vulnerable and just like humbled herself. And I feel like that is going to end up being a huge turning point for her, hopefully. But I do think that she's really talented, so I don't want her to like, I don't know, be villainized throughout the show. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is back to when they were practicing. Oh, they did an intermediate check. I wonder if they're gonna have the term check with all the judges, or like maybe one person that's gonna mentor them. If it's Tam, oh my god. Okay, so they came together? 
Oh, so they did know beforehand. Ooh. So that's how they found out that they were up against each other. That is so intense. They're just like very steady and stable and like, I'd be surprised if they made mistakes, but... Never mind. Oh. oh, wow. Wow. A little embarrassing. That's a little bit too high. This is so intense. Oh, she's brushing it really well. I think that she's nervous, to be honest. I'm surprised that she's doing not a bad job, but like, I'm surprised that she's not perfect. I feel like that's what we expect from her. But not perfect, but like, I feel like we, um, not that we expect it to be perfect, but like, we don't expect it to get this many critiques, you know? So it's kind of easier for her to put her emotions in there because she connects it to like a real thought and a real emotion. Here's her performance. I wonder if she's gonna bring more emotion. Oh, it looks so pretty. They're doing really well. Gosh. I think they're just doing so good. A part of me is kind of wanting to root for the grounders because I feel like, I don't know, I like rooting for the underdog a little bit. And I'm waiting for Jihyun to really show us what she can do. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. It's so hard. Because they're literally like amazing. They're great. She did it. Good for her. They nailed this. They're shook. Oh my god, how are the grandos gonna beat this? Jeez, I don't know how the grandos are gonna beat this, like, seriously. Mm. Yeah, like literally, Tan was like, oh, those girls almost made me cry, I felt emotional. And now the grounders are gonna have to go up against them singing Taeyong's song. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. So this is the intermediate check. I'm scared. I'm very scared. They're too like fast. This is kind of hard to watch. Oh, come on. Yeah, that was actually really not good. I just think they shouldn't have switched 
the girl to have Mean Soul do the song. Like, they should have went with the original person that was going to do it with June, and I feel like their chemistry would have been better. Mm. Seems that I've never presented with all. Yeah. To me, it feels like for a while she felt like she didn't need to work on certain things, and then she kind of got brought down, back, brought back down to kind of planet Earth, and realizes maybe I'm not as good as I thought, and I have a lot to work on. So I think that her being on the ground and having to like work hard to prove that she deserves to be an island is good for her. I don't know. I feel like she does have potential, but. Mm. Uh, there are certain mistakes that I feel like at this point you shouldn't be making uh, with your talent, you know what I mean? She has the talent, so yeah. There's just certain things that she needs to overcome. Mm. Yeah, they just should have practiced together from the very beginning. This makes me so scared. I think like I was like, okay, these girls are gonna like surprise me and like I'm rooting for them over the islanders. But now I feel like they'll do well. They'll do a lot better than the intermediate check. But I don't know now if they can be Spooko, you know, for those group, the Islanders. I'm actually so anxious. She's so confident now. First time I've seen her like that. Wow. Come on, guys, represent ground. Ooh. Wow, that's pretty. Come on, this is Tian's song. He's like, oof. Sounds amazing. Wow. She sounds really good. They're bringing the emotion. I got shivers. Girl. Wow, they're good. Okay. Oh, they're so cute. She sounds amazing. When they're like frozen at the um, a performance, it's so funny. They were actually really, really good. I I might give it to the grounders. June finally showed what she does best, and she had her little riffs in there. Like she just has like a unique voice that none of the girls have. Oh, jeez. Okay, so I'm giving the grounders the win because I feel like they brought more emotion. They brought more chemistry. Even their little back and forth was so perfect. Like, they definitely had practiced that a lot. They sounded so good together. Yeah. Their emotion was just a lot. You could see the emotion and the passion in their faces. It was just better. It was just more than the Islanders, but it's hard. But I, I personally, I would give it to the Grounders, which is very surprising. I'm so proud of them. I got shivers. I didn't get shivers with the Islanders. Ooh, okay. Their voices almost sound the same, you know what I mean? 
their voices are very similar. Ooh, but I will say the Islanders seemed more polished. Let me tell. More goosebumps. Yeah, same. She did so well. You could see the hunger in her face. She really wants to show a great performance. She wanted it more. Like all of these situations that she's gone through is just gonna make her better. She looks so cute. And yeah, I don't know. Personally, even though she's done certain things that I'm like kind of turned off by, she's so young. All these girls are young. I don't know. I feel like I give her grace, you know? I just hope people, like viewers, don't hate her for like how she acted. Because I don't know. You can grow from past things, you know? Seeing her just be vulnerable and kind of be humbled and realize, like, you know, like I, I have stuff to work on. I don't know, it makes her a little bit more likable because she feels real and maybe a little relatable. Both units did very well. I hope they give it to the grounders, but I don't know. If June wins this, I know she's going to be so happy. I really want her to get the win. I feel like she deserves it. Oh, God. Now that it's them two up against each other is so crazy. What are the odds? Please give the grounders the win! I can't tell if it's a good shock or a bad shock. <gasps> oh god, I feel so bad. Ooh! One point? What the heck? Oh my god, Fuko's gonna freak out! She's definitely gonna cry. Mm. One point! Wow. Oh my god. Oh. I am so happy for you. I'm gonna watch it again, yeah. She did such a good job, both of the girls did, but she showed what she can do. They're like, how in the world did the grounders, you know, succeed over our girls? Like, what? They're probably so shook. Especially because, like, these two girls, them, like, they have always been scoring really, really high. They're seen as, like, the top girls, I feel. So so beating them is a huge deal. Really big spell from Island. They thought, I feel like the Islanders thought that it would be a sweep, that they're gonna win each challenge, each uh, challenge, but no. The way she walked off, I kind of live for that. She's like, I won, let me go back to my teammates in ground. Mm. Ugh, it's not nice to see her smile because she's been like so, so down and like depressed for the last few like days I'm sure. And good for her because she really wants to prove herself so she got a chance to as well. Oh my god Fuko, it's okay! I think the Islanders are gonna win this because they have Juan and she is sick. She's definitely one of my favorites and in ground I feel like I don't know who is going to be like the top Dancer in ground. The creative unit, yes, but Juwan is like the leader, I think, in the dance group, so I know she's gonna pull out like a lot of creative stuff. She definitely, maybe not carry, but she is, she's gonna whip them into shape, I feel, or have whipped them into shape. She's just that good. And I feel like they're, they must feel really determined. Like, I feel like they'll do well, but I think the Islanders are gonna have it. Ooh, okay, this is the intermediate check. How did they do? Yeah, didn't they perform together, in, like, when they first got into the show? Oh, yeah, and then they battled for this part as well. I love Juwon. I feel like she's so extra, but, I don't know, it's so funny to me. They're so cute! They're really good. Ugh, I don't know what it is, what they're missing, but it's something, but I can't put a finger on it, but it was really good. Mm -hmm. Different emotional vibes, yes. Yeah, that I get. I knew it was something, but the the same. I don't know, I just expect the Islanders to be better than them.
Her, she's killing it. Wow. Oh, wow. She's good. I feel like I never really realized how good she was until this. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Yui has gotten so much better. I feel like she's very confident in herself. And you could see that. Never mind, I thought that the Islanders were going to be a lot better. Now, I like the Grounders. I, I like the choreography better, and I feel like I like how they expressed their facial expressions better. She killed it. Okay. All the girls did. Like, I expected the Islanders to bring us more emotion and fierceness, and they didn't. Mm. I love her face. Mm. I wish having one emotion. Her one kind. Mm. Yeah, uh, her facial expressions are so good. But it is one note. She doesn't switch up. You know how to be fierce. Interesting. Be elegant. And also be calm. Damn. Mm -hmm. Come on, leader. She doesn't want to be the leader anymore? It feels like I'm killing the mood. Mm. It's hard because I really don't even think that she performed poorly. It's just the facial expressions are the main thing. And then as a leader, I feel like she got stuck in her head. And it was about getting out of that. <laughs> I feel like it's important to have a leader, but it's also really important to have a good team that can support the leader, you know? I feel like that's what we're seeing. Now she feels a lot more confident. Oh my god, I'm so scared. Okay. Ooh, that looks so good. Go, go! She's good too. Mm. Wow. That was so cool. Okay, I'm loving this performance so much. Coco stands out so much. She's so good. Ooh. I feel like they're definitely showing us different faces. Here's a different vibe. So let's see if they give us like a big difference. But I feel like that's gonna make a break. Okay, so cute. These girls, all of them have improved so much. Like I'm just thinking about how a lot of these girls look so much more polished and just like the technique is so much better from the very first episode wow oh my gosh they look so cool coco i cannot coco is the star of this dance for sure but they're all killing it Woo. I love her outfit. Wow, wow. Oh, pretty. Wow. Oh my god. They all look so good. 
I feel like they were really good in the intermediate check and now I just expect them to be better. So it's like, ooh, maybe the grounders will win again. We'll see. Ooh. Okay, the girl in the flannel is definitely giving me like a lot of power. Ooh. Oh, oh my god, are we not gonna be I wanna see like what they're like, oh isn't when Monica was like amazing, isn't it? Like there definitely was some move that they do. Ugh, I wanna see it so bad. I'm so excited. Are the grounders literally going to pull like a sweep and win every single challenge? Like that would be crazy. So another two girls are being sent home. I'm so sad. Oh gosh. I don't know. I feel like I don't really get sad when it comes to elimination, like girls that get sent home. Because I feel like watching these episodes is very obvious who is good and who needs a lot more work. So I'm kind of like, oh, I don't want to say looking forward to the elimination. because That sounds horrible. But I'm kind of like, okay, like it's good to start getting rid of the girls that might be bringing the other girls down because there are some girls that it's like you know very clear that they're not at the level of a lot of the other girls so it is kind of something i look forward to oh my god that sounds horrible i'm so sorry guys anyways that's the end of episode four i don't know i very happy for jiyoon i feel like i don't know if she's getting a bad edit but i don't know if editing can kind of make her look you know, like say the thing that she said about, oh, what, I, I don't want people to see me in ground, giving people the like dirty looks and stuff just because, you know, her pride is hurt. Who knows? Maybe it is evil editing, but either way, I definitely see her growth emotionally, drill wise as well. And I'm happy that she got a chance to really showcase who she is and what she does best. And I feel like that's going to help her with her own confidence as well. Anyway. But yeah, I love this episode. Happy that the Grounders got the win in the vocal. With the dance, I don't know who's going to win, but I guess we'll wait for the next episode. But Coco was definitely a standout in the last um, performance with the dance group. And I feel like Juwan is becoming maybe my favorite or one of my favorites. I just think that she's so funny to me, she's very extra, and she's so talented. I feel like her expressions are probably one of the best in the show, even though she needs to work on diversifying her expressions, I think she's probably the most expressive, in my opinion. Um, anyways, I think either Jimin or Juwon is my favorite. It's between those two, I think. Fuku used to be, I think now it's between those two. Anyway, that's the end of this video. Also, this video might be cut short due to copyright, so definitely check out my Patreon. I have longer videos there. No um, watermark or ads. Yeah, just full episodes as well as sneak peeks. And thank you to those who are already subscribed to my Patreon. This is tier one and tier two. Your support really means a lot, so thank you so much. Um, but yeah, that's the end of this video. I thank you for watching with me, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.